Tremaine, what's going on there now? The police fired tear gas into the crowd, and I was standing about 40 feet away from where the first canisters landed. <sighs> Man, that was, that was a tough night. People were running, screaming. When they first started firing off the tear gas, I could hear the rubber bullets whizzing by my head. And there was nowhere to run. Get back! You know, we're so used to seeing those kinds of scenes in Beirut somewhere, right? Iraq. It was hard to imagine that this is America. Just for man. Watching that footage really does take me back to that moment. I remember it being so hot. Physically, the temperature was hot, but also the emotions on all sides were running extremely hot. There were armed people all around us, including people in the crowd, but also the police. That could be frightening. And that you literally are putting your life on the line to tell the story, and that's your job. And also to stay balanced and stay composed. And another night capped off by violence. And so I feel it's, it's an honor and a privilege and a responsibility for me to go in and tell those stories. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.